to my channel in today's video i'll be sharing with you my lg washer and dryer combo reviews and also how i clean it with only water vinegar and baking soda kindly stay tuned To start with guys, my washing machine is an LG washer and dryer combo, 9kg washer and 5kg dryer. It has a durable and quiet motor. You can also connect it with Wi-Fi so that you can monitor it wherever you are or anytime it is in use. Here are some instructions that are on the machine. For the first instruction, we are told that each and every time after wash you're supposed to wipe the door and also when using it don't leave the cloth at the door then when using it you are supposed to use the laundry nets for socks and panties for the washer we have the rinse and spin part quick 30 for the wool, then the extensive 60, which I normally use for my daughter, given that her clothes are normally so dirty. Then for the dry circle, we have the cupboard dry, iron dry, low temperature dry, time dry. And what I love about this machine is that it, it has a steam cycle where you can use allergy care and baby steam care. So guys, I just want to show you how I normally use my washing machine. First, we'll put the clothes in the washing machine, then wash them. Then I'll show you how I normally dry my daughter's clothes only. For the dryer, up to now, I've been using it for my daughter's clothes, especially her uniform. By the way, guys, we bought this machine purposely for our daughter since she started schooling because sometimes she can come from school and she has pee on her uniforms and maybe the uniform she's supposed to use for the next day especially the pe kids so this machine has been a savior to me and i love it so much for washing my daughter's clothes i'll only use the lavender parcel and i love 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 this liquid detergent because it smells so nice By the way guys, before buying a machine, you should consider the reasons why you need a machine, the storage capacity for your machine, also your budget, by the way, for me, I went, I went for this one because it was within our budget, and also it was on promotion on Naivas, that's why we went for that one. For drying my daughter's clothes, I use the time dry. And when you are drying the clothes, the machine will just measure the clothes and it will give you the time that the, it will run until it is done. For my daughter clothes, there were not that many, so it only took 53 minutes and that is like an hour and they were completely dry. Another thing to consider guys the type of machine you want for me from a while for a while I've been wanting LG because I've been seeing people using it and also from the reviews were so good that's why I went for LG and it is the best decision ever. Also guys this machine uses less electricity and less water since we bought it at least our water bill went down with some percentage and I'm truly happy. 
After drying, you'll have to wait for about 5 to 10 minutes for the machine to cool down so that the door can open. The drying part is done, we'll go ahead to wash our machine guys. We'll start with the lower part by opening the pipe to remove the water. Then we'll clean the cup. Inside this cup is where the unwanted objects normally go to, like the buttons, pins. You can just see how dirty it is, guys. We'll just go ahead and clean it. Then we'll go ahead and clean it with water and vinegar by just scrubbing it with a brush. Then after scrubbing it, I'll wipe it with a soft cloth. Then close it and go ahead to clean the powder tray. For the powder tray, there is a push sign. You'll just have to push it for, the, for it to come out and do it so gently. Then I'll also clean here by scrubbing it with a toothbrush. Then wipe it with the, a cloth soaked in water and vinegar. For the powder tray, I'll use water and vinegar by just scrubbing it with a brush. Then I'll also rinse it with running water from the tap. I'll use a cloth soaked in water and vinegar just to wipe it and make sure you wipe it so gently so that you don't spoil the dough. tub guys for cleaning the tub i'll use two cups of vinegar which i'll put inside the tub then for the baking soda i'll put in the powder tray i'll only use a quarter cup of baking soda and add two cups of water to the baking soda
Then set the machine to run for quick 30 with a temperature of 30. As the machine is being cleaned from inside, I'll go ahead to wipe my machine from outside with the wet cloth soap in water and vinegar. Now guys we are done cleaning the tub, we'll just go ahead and wipe the door with a dry cloth and make sure you do this each and every time you are done washing your clothes as you can see there is a sign there showing that you are supposed to wipe each and every time you are done washing your clothes. Don't you and our machine is clean guys. I truly hope you've enjoyed this video and I truly hope I've motivated someone with this video. Kindly guys give this video a thumbs up if you've liked this video and don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and also hit the notification button so that you get notified each and every time I upload a new video. I'll just go ahead and fold all the clothes that I'd wash and dry. See you in my next video guys. Bye!